Oh, you're looking at the future right here. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. WWE Universe, you are looking at a superstar who is simply blessed to be the best, just naturally better than everybody else, even when only doing the bare minimum. When you talk about some of that natural athletic talent, Corey, Bianca's been exceptional her entire life. She earned all SEC and all American honors in track and field at the University of Tennessee. And if you just ask her, she'll tell you why she's better than everybody else. You got eyes, Byron, you understand. A freak in the weight room, a beast in the ring. Bianca Belair could do it all. And she's got a lethal hair whip. Hey, Michael, Corey. What? It's glow time! I'm surprised you enjoy this this much, Saxton, seeing as how you're and afraid of the dark. And her opponent from Orlando, Florida, Naomi. It glows like having a nightlight, so it's okay. Naomi's one of the most respected superstars in all of the women's division. One of the most athletic superstars in the history of WWE. A former pro basketball cheerleader, professional dancer. Naomi can do it all from bell to bell. And one of the most fun and exciting entrances in all of WWE. Bob your head, Corey, when Naomi comes out. How can you not get lost in the moment? Go ahead, Naomi, get it, girl. I'm an unbiased broadcaster, Saxton. Oh, just a grump. The WWE Universe is chopping to the bit to see these two competitors go at it. You can count me in on the excitement. I can't wait. Up and over with a suplex. Hurricane Rana. going to work now. She wants to do this in the ring. She makes it look easy. Offense like this is exactly how a competitor takes control of the match. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good, Byron. Yeah, this is how people end up getting hurt. Bang, right to the face. Now we have Naomi on the attack. Things starting to go the other way for her. And this one appears far from over, and she knows that. You know, wow. she's the kind of competitor that actually likes getting hit. It motivates her. And this might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. It's been quite the back-and-forth battle for these women, guys. And I'm willing to bet that's the way it's going to be the rest of the way. Naomi going to work now. Back now inside the ring. Perfectly executed. That packed a punch. I've seen some unique offenses over the years, Byron, but perhaps the most unique thing I've ever seen is when Bianca whips her opponents with her own hair. I have never... The shoulders are down. And Bianca Belair with a quick kick out. Gonna take more than that. Now we have Naomi on the attack. To your point about Bianca's hair, Byron, 
I do think it's long enough that an opponent could likely use it as a weapon as well. No, that won't work. Grabbing an opponent's hair can lead to disqualification. Besides, everybody knows the best way to prevent Bianca from using her hair is to cut it off. A la Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Oh, and a backbreaker! Right to the spine. And no luck against Bianca Belair there. What an amazing maneuver. And she goes down hard. That'll leave a mark. There's no coming back from that. Nicely done. Look at her go. Naomi's going for it. Foot leg moonsault. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. Now Naomi needs to capitalize on this opportunity. There it is. It is. It's locked in. She got all of it there. Not sure how much more Bianca Belair can take. She may very well have reached the point of no return. By the looks of things, this may very well be the beginning of the end for her. This one was over once she locked it in. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up. Here we go. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Here is your winner, Naomi. A very impressive victory for Naomi. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good about yourself. And that'll do it here for this one-on-one -on -one match. I hope you enjoyed it as much as this live crowd appears to have enjoyed.